all right guys welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be talking about what makes the 4.6 liter dual overhead cam 32 valve motor so great so let's get into today's video so before we really get into it and we start talking about um, the actual motor and the benefits of having a dual overhead cam 4.6 I think the real um, dilemma or issue would be is what we came from we came from a 5 liter which is a 5.0 uh, the V8 and that was a push rod motor with one cam in the block and um, it was a very powerful platform it produced a lot of power from factory well it, it was 225 i believe and um, to replace that we got a single overhead cam motor 4.6 liter that produced i believe the same horsepower which was the 225 and it just it didn't um i guess upgrade if you know what i mean like from what we were expecting for to do from 5.0 go straight to the single overhead cam that didn't really perform the way that you wanted it to and got a lot more complicated because of the single overhead cam setup and I just believe that the dual overhead cam 4.6 the 32 valve motor uh, what a lot of people refer to as the Cobra motor no matter what it comes out of um, is the superior motor that all of the Mustangs um, should have gotten and SVT and Cobra and Roush and all of the performance versions of the Mustang probably just should have went with a beefier version of the dual overhead cam motor instead of just using that solely for their power plant so I have my own right here out of the vehicle because um, <clears throat> I bent a rod so I'm going to show you a lot of things on this block and all that uh, makes this motor superior to a lot of um, single overhead cam motors all right so first things first um <clears throat> they call it four bolt main uh, main caps uh, for the crank there's four caps there's five caps that hold down the crank and this is an all aluminum block aluminum heads on the 32 valve and um it holds uh four bolts actually hold down the main caps now they say four bolt main but actually it's six bolts because there's two bolts on the side of the block that holds down each cap so one bolt here one bolt on the next side and then if you count so one two three four five and that'd be six so that'd be six bolts that hold down these main caps um also what else let me see i know these motors this one came out of a um, 2003 Mercury Marauder and like I said um, they're all 32 valve 4.6 dual overhead cam and um, basically they're the same motor they haven't changed since they came out in 93 in the Lincoln Mark 8 the only difference is the 03 and 04 Cobras came supercharged that's the only difference every other uh 90s to 2001 i believe because i don't think there was a 2002 uh cobra are exactly the same the only difference is the the, the motor that came inside the actual cobra had a different intake cam but all of them have the same exhaust cam so the only difference between um a 32 valve 4.6 dual overhead cam motor and an actual motor that came out of a cobra is that intake cam so probably by now if you're watching this video and you own a single overhead cam Mustang you'd be saying man I want to get one of these motors and put it in my vehicle which in that would be the way to go if you're going to keep the dual overhead cam motor pretty stock which is like bolt-ons uh, underdrive pulleys and um, exhaust any cam upgrade for these dual overhead cam motors is going to be over a thousand dollars because you're not buying two cams you're buying four cams that's where it gets expensive with this thing um also if you poured out single overhead cam heads they actually flow better than factory 
uh, 32 valve heads so that's another thing to think about the only difference is it's all aluminum aluminum also means that it cannot take that heat and that boost like the single overhead cam motors can so that's another um, downfall within itself but in stock form the 32 valve is going to outperform that uh, 16 valve motor that came uh, single overhead cam uh, 4.6 so like i say another thing is the cool factor to be able to say yeah i got a cobra motor in my mustang or in my sports car or, you know that it's always been a, a very nice thing to be able to say but it's just like this mustang here its motor which is a cobra motor which is a 4.6 all aluminum dual overhead cam motor came out of a 2003 mercury marauder and uh, the motor actually came out of the um 90s cobras from 93 straight up until 2002 they were the exact same motor all aluminum 4.6 dual overhead cam the only difference is all cobra motors that were usually the Teskid or texid block um, those motors came with a different intake cam um, that set it apart from all other dual overhead cam uh, 32 valve motors but other than that they are the exact same uh, motor uh, the only reason I actually swapped that motor into this Mustang is because uh, the Marauder that the motor was in actually uh, went underwater and I didn't want anything to do with the body after that so I just uh, ended up swapping the Mustang with the uh, four valve it actually I bought this car with intentions to put the four valve motor in it so um, that was the whole purpose of getting this and doing the build which and i have about 40 videos with this car putting this car together and then finding out that i have a bent rod so uh, what i actually ended up doing is when i found out that all the motors were the same uh, just the intake will vary between different applications i ended up buying a 93 uh, cobra motor that came inside the lincoln mark 8 which actually uh, we all like to call it the Cobra motor, but it's actually the Lincoln motor because Lincoln actually had those motors in them Long before the Cobra did so Yeah, so I'm gonna be fixing my Mustang by buying the Lincoln mark 8 motor Which is the identical to the motor that I take out of it. It's just the difference is uh, the intake manifold and that's it but um, Yeah, I think that's pretty much it when it comes to um why people desire these motors so much they're all aluminum uh, 32 valve dual overhead cam it's pretty much just a cool factor because um, you could make more power out of those uh, single overhead cam motors very easily with just a turbo so um, with it being an aluminum block that will stop you from building power very quickly because I believe the 03 Marauder block was only good for about 450 horsepower before you're gonna mess things up so um other than that thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe we'll catch you guys on the next one